As you can see, they cut my video off at 19 seconds. I don't have any videos in my phone. They are trying to stop me from telling you about the Greyhound. The man is trying to ask me to hold up tickets. He's asking people to hold up tickets, trying to get me out of the station to get me killed by the thugs of the Atlanta police and the black women who harmed my pregnancy. I need to put out the evidence about my pregnancy. They're going around asking people to hold up their tickets and um, they don't want to be on camera. Um, another thing is they have white men trying to come by me as I'm charging my phone to see if I'm on my YouTube because they're with the KKK and they all know that they have the blacks trying to set me up to be killed in Atlanta. I'm going to go ahead and show my baby. This is the baby they trying to kill. Well, they trying to kill me because of who baby it is. And I came down here pregnant like this. And they abused us. And we need to be rescued. I need a, a ticket out of here because I'm going to fight. Do not touch me, Atlanta police. Do not touch me, none of y'all thugs. I have a knife. And I will use it. Don't shoot me. And don't do, do not shoot me. Don't put your hands on me. Don't try to crush my baby. Granny and the armor. Irma, Marshall, you know that I was pregnant. My grandma and my auntie Barbara. Shakina knows that I was telling y'all I'm pregnant. Granny, you need to buy me a ticket to come from here because you bought me the ticket to come down here. And I haven't talked to you guys. I don't got my family number, but I need to get in touch with some of my family that bought me the ticket to come down here to get me the ticket. I'd rather be killed in Texas where they did this to me. They did this to my body in Texas. And Atlanta police think they're going to have black people out here helping them kill it. And all these other nations. And I don't have anywhere to charge my phone. Um, I don't know how long I'm going to be able to sit here and be safe inside of the Greyhound station because I need to release the screenshots um, of the homes that they had me in and the places that they had me in here in Atlanta. I don't know what God is going to do. Jesus, do something to deliver me from this murderous city. God showed me this cute little baby in my hand. He was like, she will never want to come back to Atlanta, Georgia. I will never want to come back here. They literally are trying to trap me in the city with my child and kill me. Oh, my freaking God. Jesus, get me out of here. If there's any Christians out there, please, I, I'm afraid to read my comments. I'm afraid to uh, look at my messages because they just, nobody has helped 30, 40,000 views on my other channel and no one stepped in to tell them stop trying to kill that black woman baby and give her some medical care. That's when I saw how racist black people really was and how racist this country really was and they still trying to go through with it. I will never come back to this wicked town. I'd rather go back to racist KKK city, Texas, because everybody already knows Texas is racist before Atlanta to be acting like the black capital and to be sitting over here trying to kill my baby and stop me from putting out the evidence about what they did to my pregnancy out there in